You can build a DIY pool monitor with electronics from Adafruit and Whippersnapper, Adafruit's no-code solution to IoT projects. This uses the DS18B20 waterproof digital temperature sensor that's great for measuring wet conditions. The Adafruit ESP32 S2 features an onboard LiPo monitor and Stemma QT that makes it perfect for portable IoT projects. Everything is housed in a waterproof case with a nice long cable for the temperature sensor to be submerged in a body of water. With Adafruit I.O., you can easily build a dashboard to visualize the temperature in Celsius or Fahrenheit and the battery percentage. Using Whippersnapper, you can quickly set up your Feather ESP with the built-in components as well as any supported sensors. You can control how often to log data and see a line graph to better visualize how your data is changing over time. You can get the parts to build this project, links are in the description. This 3D printed mount houses the Adafruit Feather and it's designed to be secured in the waterproof case. A 4.7K resistor is included with the temperature sensor and it's required as a pull up from the data pin to the VCC line. The wires from the cable are color coded and soldered to the pins on the bottom of the Feather PCB. Use a quarter inch drill bit to make a hole in the enclosure for the temperature sensor to pass through. Be sure to check out the guide for a full step-by-step -step tutorial on building this project. The feather snap fits onto the 3D printed mount. The DS18B20 sensor is inserted through the drilled hole and the 3D printed mount is secured with screws. This 4400 milliamp LiPo battery fits nicely in the enclosure and plugs directly into the feather's battery port. These thumb screws are included with the waterproof case and the top cover is transparent so you can keep track of everything inside. Hot glue is great for insulating the drill hole and helps keep out any moisture from getting into the case. We've been using this project to keep track of how long it takes for our pool to reach a desired temperature. It was easy to put together and we think it's a great IoT project that could be adapted for lots of other use cases. We hope this inspires you to try Adafruit I.O., Whippersnapper, and the Feather ESP32 for your next IoT project.